What is good, everybody, and welcome back to the Pokemon Sword Gala Lock, episode 21. How are you guys doing? Hi, the kids. How's the wife? How's your mama doing? Did you did you say did you say good morning to her? I don't know where I'm going with this, but anyways, in the last episode, we uh, progressed through Route 10. It was quite a journey. It was. It was a great. It was a great journey. We had learned that our teams, even weakest links, weren't so weak as we thought. Either way. In the last episode, I mentioned that I was going to grind up Dodo, and I actually didn't have to move from this spot because I had enough rare candies to get him to level 51. I also moved his moves around just to make dive quicker to access, and I gave him a leftovers so that when he is diving, he's at least healing a little bit of HP back. That could be a difference, you know what I'm saying? I also gave Bella a Quick Claw so that maybe she could outspeed Pokemon that uh, she would normally be faster against. That special attack stat is 121, so I a mark for a sociable Pokemon. Sick. So I gave her uh, the TM for Snarl. I actually put it up front and uh, leave that. She's full dark. It's also she's still gonna nasty plot Snarl, lower their special attacks. And <gasps> it's gonna be great. Everyone else I believe is the same. That's the hiccup for the episode. Uh, I took the the luck incense off of Chinwag because we don't need money anymore. We really don't. And I gave a scope lens which heightens his critical hit ratio. So that'd be pretty fun. This was pretty. This was a really. Uh, Butchered team recap, but hey, it's a team recap nonetheless. So let's get out of here and let's see what Windon has to offer us. Let's see if there's another. Is there a new clothing store here? I want some new clothes. Like I know we're about to, like we're about to, we're about to take uh, some axe We don't that we can't use. We're about to take on. Is that a clothing store? We're about to take on. Um, there's the clothing store. We're about to take on. I'm assuming the tournament of, of power. Shout out to Dragon Ball Z. We're about to do the tournament to see who's the best, you know, trainer in all of Alola. So your boy's got to look a little better. Can we get a better jacket? What if we just not wear one? Yo, yo, yo. I like it. How do we do this, though? I want black, but our shirt's already black. Do we just get white? Nah, we get black. $111,000. It's worth. Worth. Already purchased. All right. Bottoms. What do our bottoms already look like? Okay, so the track bottom's red. Let's see what we got here. Rock type is all black. I like that. I like that. Can we get different bottoms? Leather trousers. That's what I'm talking about. Can we get all black? We can. We can get red. This is actually what my trainer in uh, Pokemon Shield's wearing is the red trousers, but that's a female. So I guess the black ones don't look bad on you. Let's go with black. Yo, we're almost out of money. Already? As I, after I said we didn't need any. Pattern leggings. Hold the phone. I don't think we need those. Uh, new shoes. Let's go, dude. So anyway, I literally just uh, leveled up Cramorant off screen and then click record again. I'm keeping this vibe going, dude. I don't know what the levels are going to be like uh, when we get into there. I think I'm just going to get the blacks. Where are the black ones? Creeper's black. These look really weird, but I, I mess with it. We're only at 32,000 HP left. HP. Our bag is good. Our bag is. We don't want to cap. Uh, we nor. Are we already? Yeah, we're already wearing sunglasses. We're good here. Uh. Do we get a sick thingy? Red gas. Let's do that. Why not? Anyways, we're we're styling, profiling now. We're ready for this tournament, dude. Let's get out of here. We have twenty thousand dollars to our name. That's fine. We didn't need to buy anything else. Look at us, bro. Strike a pose, Q2. Just do it on him. Uh, let's go. All right, I'm ready. I'm ready. But yeah, I really was just like, I was really feeling the energy from the last episode, and I wanted to carry that into this one. And like, you know, maybe I'm making a bonehead play by doing this. Oh snap! Camera changes. Look at that. Maybe I'm making a bonehead play, and uh, you know, going very recklessly into this thing. Do we go into here first? I honestly, don't know where we need to go now. I know I just needed to get these uh, these threads. I guess we don't go here. Could have fooled me. Maybe we just go straight to the uh, to the area, right? We take this thing up. There's an item there. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Master ball. Air balloon. I'll take it. Wonder. I wonder if that if that pops in game. I know when it pops like online, you get it back after the battle's over. But if it pop, I wonder if it pops in game, it's gone forever. That would suck if it is. I don't see them doing that though, honestly. I don't really see them doing that. Another Pokemon Center. So we may as well just go in here. Talk to everybody. What y'all doing? Y'all talking about stuff. Y'all, you also... Ooh, you want to sell me anything? 
Mr. Plant, I'm literally talking to the plant. <gasps> Drain punch. Yo, I think Galarian Darmanitan could learn that. We don't have enough money. Oh, I'm selling stuff, bro. Bro, I need that. I need Drain Punch in my life. Uh, we have treasures. We literally don't need any of these things. I right, don't have enough yet. Don't have enough yet. Don't have enough yet. Honey, don't have enough yet. We're close. Fossilot, you know what? I'm gonna give it a four of these. I actually, sh I never got the fossil encounter. It just dawned on me. I don't even know what the fossil encounter is. I honestly forgot. I never got it. Anyways, we got enough for the drain punch. Oh, I stopped talking to him for some reason. Bye, bye, bye. All these shells, shells, shells. We're gonna drain punch. We could learn Thunder Punch too. I wonder if that's a thing. Let's see if Galarian Darmanitan can learn Drain Punch. If that's the case, bro, we are literally gonna be unstoppable. We are literally gonna be unstoppable. Please let me learn Drain Punch. It's on Fort. No one can learn Drain Punch, not just wasted 50k on it. Anyways, that's how this episode's gonna start off. What do you wanna say, sir? Loads of people, something about security. I'm out of here. I like your Pokeball slots, they look really nice. Nice and form fitting. But, uh, yeah, this is literally still the same day as I said before. Like, not even five minutes after I ended episode 20. Which, uh, if you haven't checked it out, bro, go check out episode 20. I was really feeling myself with that episode, bro. Dodo, like, just, just surprised the hell out of me. He really did. We get a dream ball. It's about to achieve our dreams. Somewhat difficult Pokemon that makes it easier to catch wild Pokemon when they're sleeping. Pokemon that are asleep are easy to catch, but did you ever want it to be even easier? Well, the Dream Ball will make your dreams come true. Okay. Sick. Alright, so there's Hop. Do you want to battle me, bro? This is the reception desk. Alright. Let's just get into it, man. I don't know how far we're going to get into the tournament in this episode. But uh, anyway, this guy's saying, we've been watching over your performance in the gym challenge. This is just a formality, of course, but I'll need to check your badges if you don't mind. Bro, I'm literally the main character. I'm all sorted. I'm ready to battle. You on the big... I'm, a... I'm all sorted. ready to battle. You on the biggest stage of them all. But it looks like BD could make it. Speaking of which, shout out to uh, shout out to Twitter for uh, pronouncing BD. Uh, it seems to be the general consensus consensus that uh, BD's name is is actually pronounced BD instead of B. Whatever it, whatever the anime decides to, you know what I mean. When, you know we could hear from Shigeru, Shigeru, Shigeru Miyamoto might be his name. One of the, one of the Nintendo guys, if they want to pronounce his name like BD or Bead, that's that's I guess that's the you know canonical way to pronounce it it really doesn't matter call it what you want this is this is a world of endless possibilities my hand just rose out of nowhere and i you know didn't see hop's dialogue but he said i guess it is what it is and that is exactly the model i'm getting that tatted on my forehead it is what it is come on q2 reach your hand to the locker room i definitely carried over some of that energy into the next attention gym challengers who have made it through the gym challenge the summer finals will be starting soon Please head to the stadium pitch when you are ready. Now, I don't remember who our first challenger is, but I do remember it's either Marnie or Hop. I can't imagine it being Hop straight away, so we might end up having to destroy Marnie right now. And if that's the case, Marnie, if you're watching, it's good. <laughs> Let's do this. We just bought the freshest of outfits, but we don't get to wear it. It's whatever. It is what it is. It's Marnie. Oh. At first I was afraid. I was petrified. Hey, <laughs> I knew you'd get all the bed. I'm gonna make... I'm gonna, my sister, uh, not requested. But she's assumed that I was gonna give Marnie a soft voice. And for the most part, I've been giving Marnie, like, a hardcore, like, British, like, like, oi, what you doing? You know what I mean? Type of voice. But I'm gonna give her this nice little... <laughs> I knew you'd get all the badges of Mimi here. I know that there's been a lot between us. What, with my big brother... Team Yell helping Spike Muth and all that. But the truth is, when all's said and done, I really just want to become champion for myself. So don't take a personal kid when I kick your butt. Spoilers, she's not gonna win. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I love the way she stands. I love everything about this woman. Sent out a Liper. Did we lead off with a uh, Frozone? I hope we did. Okay. Okay, 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 So, I gotta win this if I'm gonna be the champion. I'm coming at you with everything I got. Super anime. Anyway, that's a good thumbnail. Let me just do that one. That was bad. That was, the first one was better. Anyways, 
Uh, this thing can outspeed me if it has Sucker Punch. Sucker Punch goes before you if the if they attack. Either way, uh, yo, do we Dynamax turn one? No, that's not the play. Uh, I'm gonna Ice Punch. Nasty plot. He outspeeds a Choice Scarf on Manitan? No, he's Prankster. He's gotta be Prankster. That's Prankster. Please kill. Please kill. Can't stop Frozone. Not when we're synced with the Froze. You can't stop him. You just can't. It just can't hang. Knock on wood before he gets stopped, honestly. Chinwag is level 53. Marty sent out a Scrafty. That is a fighting dark type. I am ice punching. I'm just ice punching. I'm ice punching. What else is there to do? Is she gonna Dynamax for more Pico? That didn't kill. No. No. Yo. Imagine we died. I'm ice punching. Bro, imagine we died. Don't imagine it. I'm already imagining it. And I'm sad. I'm sad. And I regret everything. Alright. Uh, that's two Pokemon down. Let's see what happens next, boys. Toxicroak. That's a poison fighting type. Poison fighting. He could go for a poison type move. And really hurt my empath on switching. Because that's who I want to switch into. But if he goes for a fighting type move, then I'm good. Uh, either play is covered by Poaz. And I can heat crash his man. And if he's dry skin, is he anticipation? He might be anticipation. If he, I didn't see it pop up, so he might not be. But it only would have popped up if Frozen would have had a super effective move, which he didn't. So, he's going for Toxic. I could have just stayed in and killed this thing. Uh, I guess I'm glad I didn't go out into Empath, I suppose. I just heard a Big Bang. Did a universe just get created over here? Like, what just happened? Am I too loud? Uh, I'm gonna heat crash this toxic cruel. Then a shock. That's gonna hurt. I lied. I lied. I'm a liar and a fool. That did not hurt whatsoever. Yo, I can't wait to put Marnie in the thumbnail again. <laughs> I can't wait to put Marnie in the thumbnail again. Uh, let's see. Should I? No, because I feel like if I just do a video poor battle, it's gonna be super short. So I might do Marty hop, and then, yo, this more Pico is a problem. I'm gonna full restore, see what he wants to do. Okay, so she's not Dynamaxing her more Pico, so that's cool. Do you have something else you want to Dynamax, bro? What do I have for, uh, for more Pico? Is more Pico, okay, more Pico's electric, right? And he's just going for Torment. That's fine, I healed. And at the end of every turn, he turns to a dark type. Oops, go, get out of your bag, Poaz. So, uh, I should have stealth rocked at the beginning of this. I gotta lead off a of Poaz next time. Uh, do I just Dynamax straight up? What do I get from that? Normal time move to lowest speed. Rock time move to summons a sandstorm, and then my special attack will be boosted. Summons. Huh. Let's do it. I don't see. I don't see it. I don't see a downside in Dynamaxing right now. I know Poez has been Dynamaxed a lot this series, but yo, we need Poez for this end game, and we're gonna use him. Who on our team hasn't been Dynamaxed? Cramorant or Bella? All right, Operation, get one of them to Dynamax in this uh, in this uh, tournament. All right, we're not gonna go first because uh, that thing is just fast. Sparky, spark, spark! Don't paralyze me, dog. Thank you. Max Rockfall. If this doesn't kill the sandstorm, surely will. It should kill. It didn't kill. It just didn't kill. Hey guys! It didn't kill. I don't know. I thought it was gonna. Anyway. This next turn where Pico's dead. I'm just gonna max rock fall again, because I lose nothing out of that. Do not get paralyzed, Poaz. You're a well-trained Poaz. Thank you, brother. Alright. So we now have one turn of Dynamax left, and I do not know what her last Pokemon is. And she's 100% Dynamaxing it. But that's just what they do in this game. They Dynamax on the last turn. I've got everyone's cheers back at me. I'm really, really gonna win this time. Got it? Grimmsnarl. Uh, don't be a Gigantamax Grimmsnarl. He probably is. Right? That's only right. 
my bro might not use it, but I'll Gigantamax my Pokemon if it's to win. Oh, yeah, she, I love her eyes. I've never even seen those before. Oh, my God, those are so blue. I've probably seen them before, but it's never paid attention to it. They look so good. I can just step. Yo, that thing looks insane. Shout out to Symbiote. This is for you. Well, he's going to outspeed us, but... I work real hard training my favorite move just so I can use it in a battle against you, G-Max Snooze. G-Max Snooze. If you guys don't know, G-Max Snooze is freaking broken. And it flicks yawn on the on the on its on me. I'm yawned. I became drowsy. It hurts you and it flicks yawn. It's insane. I'm gonna go to sleep. So I have to swap out. I don't have to swap out. I suppose I can stay in. I don't think anyone else. I don't know what's going on my, with my body right now. I'm good hiccups and burping. I don't think I die from any one move from this thing. She max news again. I guess it's good that I stayed in then. Hashtag bars. Hoag. 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 You're asleep? I didn't even get the... I didn't even get to attack! I didn't even get to attack! That's this game! This game's broken! Anyways. We're gonna stall turns with healing because I don't care. I really don't. Use your G-Max news again, bro. It won't help you. It just won't. Does a full restore get rid of the drowsy effect? That's the question. Does it? I don't think it does. Could be wrong. Man, what I wouldn't do for toxicity right now. Uh, we're just gonna full restore again. I don't see a, I don't see a reason not to, honestly. Call it what you want. Call it Star Wars. Star Wars. Shout out to Star Wars. I've actually never seen. I never watched any form of Star Wars before. I heard. I heard good things. I heard good things. Just never gave it a chance. Uh, I saw he crash. We probably don't weigh that much. Torment. Torment me, Grim Snarl. Deal it. Don't put me to sleep. Alright, I do get the heat crash off. Nice, 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 nice. And that is a dead Grimstar, and that is Marty knocked out of the playoffs. Or the tournament. Get out of the tournament, Marty. You played well, but not well enough. Empath, good little 52, doesn't want to learn anything. It's okay, Marty. So I lost. But I got to see a lot of the good points of you and your Pokemon. Yes, you did. You really, you really, you're the real winner here. Bro, I don't know what it is. I really don't. Everyone in the stadium was watching us during all that. I heard them cheering for me and my Pokemon. It was nice. I may have lost, but at least we drove the audience wild. Guess that's not so bad. Thank God Joey, my brother in the stands. And we'll watch from the sidelines to see who ends up challenging that champion. Just so you know, I still haven't decided if I'm going to cheer for you. See ya. She's cheering for us one way or another. You do. I'll be waiting for you in the final match. After seeing the way you battle, I can't accept any outcome besides winning this match. My team is on fire! Alright, sick, bro. So wait, was that it? We're in the semifinals and in the finals? Straight up? Okay, so. What I want to do is... Pardon me. I know you didn't get along great, but the match before yours ended more quickly than expected. Challenger Hop won quite handily. So as soon as you're ready, we'd like you to back on the pitch. Alright, bro. Well, here's what we're going to do. Where are, are we healed? We are healed. I love, I love that. Uh, why did I go to my box? Didn't want to do that. I am going to go like this, and then go like this. And that's how I want to do it. I want to click Stealth Rocks of Poaz. That's what I want to do. I also want to save. We only have 37 Pokemon we caught in this Pokedex. That's hilarious. Alright, so I want to lead off with Poaz. No matter what he leads off with, I don't care what it is. It could be... He doesn't have Inteleon. He has a Grookey. But it could be... He, did, he does have a... He has his starter. Oh man, I just remember we lost. We lost Go Tanks before we became a Cinderace. Imagine if Go Tanks was with us, bro. Imagine if Go Tanks was with us. RIPs to Go Tanks. I just got sad. <laughs> I just had this sort of flashback, you know. Remember back when we were still in Postwick? When we got a Pokemon from Lee that day? I never would have dreamed that I'd end up standing here facing you of all people. He's really taking it all in. But it's not finished when it started that day. Got it? The one who become champion is me. I don't think so, Hop. I'm the main character. It's called Pokemon Sword and Shield, not Pokemon Hop. This is some good music. Slap yourself, silly. We leading off with 
Oh, the double. His partner Pokemon from before he had a starter. That's fine, bro. What do you want to go for? Like Cotton Guard or something? I'm going to Stealth Rocks. We battle back on the Garden, but I'm really, really fired up for this match in the stadium. Yo, okay, is he, does he have Body Press? Does he have access to Body Press? I'm still Stealth Rocking. Cotton Guard, please don't have access to Body Press. My defense is really high. But it is super effective. If he goes for a Body Press. I'm really fearing that. He crashes physical. Angel Power is going to do nothing. I'm going to Heat Crash. Zen Headbutt. Okay, we, we'll live in that. We'll live in that every day of the week. Don't get flinched, Poez. Thank you. My neck itches. Alright, that did absolutely nothing. We're going to Angel Power. Hope for some boost this is. Zen Headbutt can miss. It doesn't. Don't flinch me. Alright, we, we break through. Angel Power, give me the boost. I believe. I believe. I don't. I didn't believe hard enough. I'm gonna try it again. Reversal. I never. I should have never doubted Poaz. I was scared there for a second. How's that? I learned a lot by studying these old matches. Yeah, you learn how to lose. You learn how to get burned. Cause I got the flame body, Poaz. Get off me. You can't stop him. You just can't. Uh, so that should kill. It doesn't kill. Just burn kill. It does. And we didn't get any boost. Unfortunate. But we got the kill. I'm really in the mood for nuggets right now. For whatever reason, I just tasted a nugget in my mouth. I definitely don't have any nuggets in my mouth. But I tasted one just now. And now I want nuggets. That is a Snorlax. He should be getting hit by rocks. He does. Do I? He's going to curse, right? How do I deal with this? Foul play? Dodo? Do I stay in? He's gonna have he's gonna have a heavy slam, right? We know he has heavy slam. Does he have super power? Maybe I heal up and he pro maybe I heal up and see what he goes for. He probably just goes for curse. He probably just goes for curse. Far oh my. Okay. Well then. We should have went hard Cramorant like we wanted to. We're doing it now. Dodo, show him why you're the boss. Alright, don't hurt me, please. 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 Go for it again. Power's power. There it is. There it is. That's a like ground type immunity Cramorant. Let's do it. Uh, I'm diving. I'm diving. I am diving. I am diving. I've dove. You're going to heavy slam? Oh, that's killing me. Oh, that's killing me, bro. That's killing me. No, not like this, Dodo. Not like this, Dodo. No, Dodo. Dodo! How much do I weigh? That dropped his defense? That has a chance to drop defense? I'm just gonna dive to get HP back, honestly. Unless he goes for if he goes for rest, then I misplay. But like, I'm just gonna. I oh, didn't go for rest. I don't think he has it. That's a kill. That's a kill. Your defense is lowered. I'm a dodo. I just thought he missed for some reason because it took an extra long time. Bro, and Cramorant retains his fish, bro. And he retains his fish. Yo, I honestly doubted Cramorant, bro. I really did. I really doubted this man. He's proving himself worthy. I like it. Who cares if we got two water types on the team? It doesn't matter. That's an electric type. Now it matters. Uh, he doesn't have electric surge. So that's cool. Electric type. Who's got high special attack? I mean, special defense. 76. 110. Not bad. I go out in a Poaz, I suppose. But he's kind of hurt. I guess Empath is the play. Let's go out and Empath. This thing's going for like Volt Switch, Thunderbolt, something like that. Thunderbolt. Okay, he does have a super effective move. That actually did damage. Bro, if we don't one-shot this thing, Empath is gonna die. That was a neutral Thunderbolt. Like, just a normal Thunderbolt. 
Come on, pin Kirchen. That did... Looks like 51. This this choice spec's dazzling me. Better murder this thing. It's just pure electric type. Okay, whew, we're good. It's slower than an empath as well, so that's kind of weird. But it is what it is. Uh, that's a Corviknight. We cannot stay in on a Corviknight, but what do we go out into? Uh, Unnerved. He's going to go for a Steel type move. Easily. I want to go out into a Pokemon that I want a Dynamax. I want a Dynamax Dodo. But I don't... He's not going to be able to hurt Corviknight in a good way. Poez is the answer to Corviknight. The only answer to Corviknight. And he's kind of hurting. And I can't stay in with Empath on a Steel type. And I don't, but I don't want to risk Poez. I honestly I live whatever he goes for though. Yeah, I have to, I gotta. I live whatever this man goes for. Anything he goes for, I live. Knock on wood. Right, you're going for Steel Wing, and I live that. Swagger. No one on a corner got a swagger like Corby. Swagger like Corby. Swagger, swagger like Corby. Oh, that's a throwback if I've ever heard one. Either way, he went for Swagger like a like a. I mean, he might have predicted the switch, I suppose. But I'm gonna. Uh, I'm gonna full restore. Remind. I was gonna say, did I use it on Poaz? Remind me. I'm gonna have to remind myself. But remind me, Q. Remind me to. Uh, was I was I supposed to do? What was I supposed to remind myself to do? I forgot. I'll, I'll, I'll figure it out. I'm going to... Do I Dynamax right now? Let's start with the sun. What's this last Pokemon? It's Rillaboom. I Dynamax right now and start with the sun. Yo, the second time we're Dynamaxing Poez. Like, yeah, he's honestly just that good. Like, he's just good. Like, he's just good. He's just good. Look at my big rock man. Love him. Love him. Nothing. Did nothing. What are you doing? That's dead. That's a dead Corviknight. Please. And we set up the sun for the next Max Flare. I knew you'd be aiming for a super effective hit. I love that backdrop. Or the sky, I should say. The sky looks dope. Sunlight turned harsh. Did pose a Corviknight fainted? Die, Corviknight. Jodogu's level 52. Think you got me back in the corner? No way. This is just for you all the better. You're not about to sweep me with Rillaboom. It's not gonna happen. Dynamax him for no reason. Go ahead. I should name my Rillaboom and Pokemon Shield Vegeta. I think if I got a shiny one, I would name it Vegeta. Release all the thoughts poured into my wishing star. Time for a Dynamax. I want to wait. I was. I want to shiny hunt the starters, but I want to wait for their hidden abilities to come out. Cause I want to use them in competitive and like while they're still good with their regular abilities, Torrent. Torrent for water type, overgrowth for grass type, and uh, blaze for the fire type. They're, they're good, don't get me wrong, but like, the hit abilities are so much better. Rillaboom gets grassy surge. Uh, Cinderace gets uh, gets an ability that's basically like Greninja's ability, Protean, where it turns into every move is a stab move because it turns. Was that Earthquake? Max Flare's killing. Max Flare's killing. It's physical. Max Flare's killing. I don't even doubt it for a second. Max Flare's killing. Let's go. Ah. You're not going to endanger my po ass. I forgot what I was saying. You're done, Hop. You're done. Go sit in the stands. You're done. You're just done. Yo, these gym. Who wants to learn Rock Blast? Not me. All right, got it. po ass wants to learn it. I probably should have talked to him, but being honest. You're done. You're done. He's about to have a stroke. I respect it. Thanks, mate. I'm really glad you were the one here with me. I respect it, bro. I really do. I really do. And the victor of the semifinals, the challenger who has won their way through all the many hopeful trainers and gym challenges, Challenger Q2. Ah, the crowd goes wild. Oh, my God. You know, even when Sony was saying that you and me look like we could become heroes, I never really felt like one. But you might, I think maybe you really could do all sorts of great things. Good on you, Q2. And Colossal did some good work. I didn't read the last sentence, but I'm assuming he said he did some good work. 
That's what he did. I can't believe that man had an earthquake. <laughs> Leon, bro, calm down. Q2. That was incredible. Brilliant. Honestly, there were even tears rolling down my face before I knew it. To think that the two of you set out together from the same town, built up the greatest teams, and arrived here at this point to throw everything you had at one another. That burning desire to win. Those moves filled with undefeatable passion. Uh, it was bad battling at its very purest, in every possible way. Even though there were some trainers who weren't sure whether you were fit to be endorsed for the gym challenge at first. Um, that was Yuli. Well then, all the more reason. My team is now will give everything that we've got in us to defeat our challenger. And the challenger standing before us might well end up being you, Q2. In fact, that's precisely what I'm hoping for. We only have to fight two people to do this. That's right, Q2. The real challenge is coming next, and I'm completely exhausted. I just want to head back to the hotel and rest. Best to refill your energy stores first. Why don't we go get some dinner together? I wouldn't say no, but you never care at all what food tastes like, Lee. And not like this, as there's more than rubbish takeaway, so at least pick something good. Alright, so we're going on a date with Lee. Sick. Do I... Yeah, I guess we'll, if we get teleported there, we may as well just do it then. Yeah, that was lit. I'm, I'm not gonna lie, bro. That was so fun. That was, I don't know who to give the thumbnail to. Marnie or Hop. I might try and force them together. Q2, Q2, got some time for questions? First question. You and Chandra Hop are both endorsed by the champion, making the two of your rivals in a sense. Wouldn't you say? How does it feel to have defeated your rival? I'm glad I could beat him. It doesn't quite feel real yet. It was just luck that I won. I'm glad I could beat him. Right, question number two. If you wanted to tell Chandra Hop something right now, what would it be? I'm going to look this man in the eyes, and I would thank him for a great match. Question three. Let me le level with me, kiddo. Your honest thoughts here. Think you can win the finals too? Absolutely. All right, that's enough. Q2 is already tough in battle, and you've been asking rather rude questions. Just because you were involved in two of one of them, calm down, bro. We've got ourselves dinner plans with my brother, so sorry, but clear off already, would ya? Yes, yes, I understand. Looking forward to seeing the final battle, brother, my new star. <laughs> so what do I call this? The semifinals? Few famous people sure have it rough, eh? Galar League. Galar Lock semifinals? I hope Lee feels. <laughs> Let's just go. <laughs> I'm like. I'm like, uh. What am I like? Several hours later. This is absurd. Even Lee's never been this late. Something's not right. He always does what he says he'll do. As a kid, he promised me he'd become a champion one day, and he went and just did just that. He ought to be able to keep to his own dinner plans. If that's your only, uh. Bro, fan favorite peers over here. Kids sure got a mouth on him, huh? If you were that noisy during battle, you'd unleash a whole new level of power, you know. Oh, pack it in, Piers. I see him seriously worried here. So I don't need to pack it in. I'm gonna use that. So I don't need to see your smug mug looking like you're having a go at me, even though you act like you're giving me good advice. Judging my appearance is, eh? No wonder who you lost to your mate. If you're looking for... <laughs> Yo, the shade being thrown right now. If you're looking for the champion, I saw him heading to Rose Tower. Why would he go there? Don't know what he's up to, but I ran into him at the monorail platform. You hear the monorail platform? <laughs> I started like crazy. He said to tell you that he has something to do at Rose Tower, so he'd be late for your dinner. But why Rose Tower? What could he have done to be a little long long? Piers, do us a favor. Take us to Rose Tower, would ya? Neither Q2 nor I know the way. Sheesh, we're rude siblings, always so demanding of others. Though I suppose it's a real problem for me too if the finals are held up for any reason. And I don't really hate the two of you little runs. You were good enough to beat me after all. So I think I'll invite Team Y'all along. And we'll all have ourselves a bit of fun, shall we? Brilliant! You're the best, peers. Let us go make a real ruckus. Alright, let's do it. Let's do it. We look so good. I'm not gonna lie. Alright, peers. Am I healed up? Am I ready for this? Or what's about to happen? Let's... Let's get, why am I keep going to my box? You know, let's just look at some things. I already looked at you. You holding an item. Anybody in here holding an item? No, okay. Pikachu, you don't count Pikachu. You're not real. All right, we're gonna, I don't know why I did that. I really needed to do that, but I, here it is. This is what we're doing. All right, we did it. Anyways, uh, do we continue on or do we see what happens in the next episode? You know what? I'm either way. I'm continuing on. I'm literally finishing this game in this sitting right here, like while I'm sitting here for the next hour and a half. Maybe, maybe I'm not. Man, why am I here for this? I'm totally exhausted from that battle with you, Q2. Yeah, you are. Uh, we decided that Team Yellow would cheer you on, Q2. Let's help out together. 
Look at you, my Pico. You're so beautiful. What a beautiful display of sibling love. However, it is entirely unnecessary. I hate this woman. Miss Olina. Chairman Rowe is with the champion in a very important meeting. There's no way I will let anyone interfere. After all, only authorized personnel with the proper key can ride the monorail to Rose Tower. That means as long as Chairman Rose is in the tower, no one can disturb him. I have hand selected a member of the league staff and given them a key. Chairman Rose does enjoy these kind of menial games after all. Do you think you can tell the difference between normal league staff and the one I chose? Do you think you can find me? I guess, I don't know. Is this the mission? What should we do? Tish, this isn't good, but I got this one. Q2, Team Yell's yelling, will you handle this? No, this is brilliant. I'll search around the front of the stadium. For now, we should try to head to the plaza together, right? Sure. All right, let's all work together and head for Rose Tower. Yeah, I really don't want to stop. Is this about to be like an hour-long episode? I don't think so. It shouldn't. I don't think I should be doing that. Let's find Alina's league staff member. That one was wearing those lame shades, right? I honestly didn't get a good look at him. But he wasn't that guy. I think his shades were all black. Is it you? Is it really just you? Okay, I guess it's not. Is it... Marnie's over there. Is it you, bro? It's gotta be, right? It's this guy. Okay, it's not you. Is it the guy literally that's sitting over there? If it is, I'm gonna be pissed. Bro. Do we have to talk to these guys in a certain order? Okay, it's not him. Well, then what's going on? Is it you? Oh, it's, it's definitely him. This guy's looking at the wall. It's definitely him. Bro, fight me, dog. Fight me. Cosmos Eric. Macro Cosmos Eric, is that the name of their like establishment? This is a steel type, of course it is. We got a Frozone. zone. I don't think you kill me with any one attack. We're level 55. I'm fire fanging. I'm fire fanging. I fire fang. You only have a meowth? Please tell me you only have a meowth. I don't wanna have to do this again. He's got a Durant Durant. Uh, we're murdering this Durant. My cheers will really get you going. Yes, they will. Thanks. Raise attack. Speed, I'll take it. We're choice scarfed. We're outspeeding this man. 100%. Land! Let's go. That's dead. That's a dead Durant. You don't live. You don't live. You just don't. Chill to level 54. Hashtag Brian Erlacher. Macrocosmos Eric's gone. Die, zombie. Now, I actually do remember this little mission. Uh, when I first played this game, uh, I think during this moment, he actually got he got the better of me. Maybe it wasn't during this moment. Maybe it's the next one. But, uh, yeah, you'll see. That's not you. Is he over there? No, he's not over there. Okay. Is he right here? He is. He's always got his back turned to you. Back turned to you. So just, you know, if, you, if you're playing along and you just don't remember that, so I always got his back turned you so that you can't see his sunglasses, okay? But anyway, he's got a Maw while, Which I'm just gonna fire fang. It's not a Mega Maw while cause... Megas aren't in the game. So I'm gonna fire fang this Maw while's dead. So he's been using nothing but Steel types, right? I'm pretty sure... Yeah, nothing but Steel types. <gasps> oh, enjoy, what's the prize? Feel that flow, yeah, you feeling the Q2? I am feeling it, Mr. Krabs. Let's go! Spadef rose sharply. This man's a physical attacker, Marnie, and you're gonna raise my Spadef? It doesn't matter. He's dead. It's just not hard. Especially when you're Galarian Darmanitan's level 55. Are we too high of a level? I can't I can't downgrade my levels, you know what I'm saying? Like. I've just, I've skipped a bunch of trainers throughout this series. I fought, you know, the poke, the, the people that were in front of me is all I did. So this moment right here, I'm like, oh, he ran to the left. Wherever could he be? Never once looked at this phone booth. 
And that's where he was. Just right there. Just right there. It was just... It's not hard. I just bit my lip. On accident. Or did I? It wasn't an accident. I gotta stop flirting with this webcam, man. This webcam is starting to... Starting to get to know me a little too much. A Pharaoh Seed? You really don't have a Pharaoh Thorn, brother? You have a Pharaoh Seed? I'm gonna Fire Fang you. Bite that Pharaoh Seed. Sure, I'll get hurt by Iron Barbs. But that's worth to kill the murder this thing. So yeah, this this guy's a steel type user. Is Alina a steel type user? Did we get the battle Alina? I do believe we do battle Alina. Spoilers if you didn't know. Now that's a Steelix. Marnie, are you gonna raise my attack? Marnie, if you raise my attack, I'll stay in. You're the best, Marnie. Raise my attack, please. I'm not even looking. I'm not even looking. I'm clicking. I'm clicking A. I'm not even looking. I'm clicking A. I'm not even looking. I am looking because I'm looking on the left side of the screen. And we killed that Steelix. No sturdy. He must have had the rock head ability. Let's go. Let's go. I'm just insane right now. I might I might need to stop recording. If I record another episode, bro, like I'm gonna go I'm not gonna not go insane in a bad way. I'm just gonna like go off I'm just gonna be super unfiltered. I'm I'm typically unfiltered, but it's focusing. I'm typically unfiltered. I just spit everywhere again. I'm typically unfiltered. I don't really like sh I don't sugarcoat much. But I'm just gonna start saying some crazy things. If I if I keep making I'm probably gonna keep recording though to be honest with you. Pay attention to this hoodie. This is gonna be the same. And the hairstyle. I might save the finals for something else though. What's going on here? Bro, I don't have time for this. It's the guy on the far right, unless you're about to do some shuck and jiving. I love you, boots. I said boots. Calm down. Yo, look at this man. Look at this. I love him. You did a cracker job of concerning that bad league staff member Q2. Let me sing you a song fitting of your rockin' deeds. The only thing a humble singer can do is sing a humble song. Maybe I can't cheer someone on just with the tunes I play. Maybe songs don't make anyone happy. Maybe I can't help. But still, the only thing I can do is sing. Sing my humble song. Piers, oh my god! Go, Piers! Hey, isn't that Piers? What's he doing in a street performance? Oh, I think he mean a station performance. Come on, let's see if we can get closer. Okay, guys, come on. Let's just fast. This is a great. This is a great scene. I love this scene. It is like total like people of New York helping Spider-Man scene. It's a really good scene. And Zix, I'm pretty sure there was an Easter egg in the video that in the video in uh this not maybe not I didn't maybe I didn't find it in the series but I remember playing in my. In my regular playthrough, someone mentioned like Zigzagoons really like to dance, and if they hear a melody, they just they'll just dance, and it's kind of like a, uh, it's kind of like a nice little you know little, little thing. But either way, we're here. We're at the Duraludon Tower, and this has been such a long episode—43 minutes, probably end up being 45. So what do y'all think? This is Rose Tower. All right, this is Rose Tower. We're gonna say 100%. Look at us. So what should we do? Team Yellow is going to have their hands full holding up these bad League staff members. They won't be catching up anytime soon. I did not use their voice at all. Let's go on ahead. Wait for the others to catch up. Let's go ahead. Good thinking. Let's go collect Lee and get out of here. Without him, there's no champion for you to challenge in the Champion Cup. Of course not. Q2, you cleared the way to Rose Tower. And all you got to do is charge on ahead. I'm not, I got this. An employee's an employee, I guess. Seeing that exec lady hit the monorail key to try and impress the chairman. Chairman Roseman keeping the champion hold up inside. Wonder what he's plotting. She's, she's concerned. And I love you. Times like this when tension and passion run high remind me of Spike Muth in the old days. Some wild concerts we had back then, but no encores. Wait, you're still here? You better get going. I'll send some support for your way with a yell. Gotta stick around and make sure you're my bro doesn't do anything too crazy, right? Come back if you need anything. Okay. <laughs> Let's go, Q2. Let's do it, boys. So, we will be entering Rose Tower. In the next episode, if you guys like what you saw and you saw what you liked, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. <gasps> I just burped. Peace!